Hello and welcome to this comprehensive training session on PT-141, also known as bremelanotide, a peptide primarily used for treating sexual dysfunction. During this session, we will explore its mechanism of action, clinical applications, dosage protocols, risks, benefits, alternatives, and patient considerations. Additionally, we will review three clinical case studies and recommended laboratory evaluations to ensure safe and effective use. Let's get started. PT-141 or bremelanotide is a synthetic peptide analog of alpha melanocyte stimulating hormone, AMSH, derived from the melanocortin hormone pathway. Unlike phosphodiesterase inhibitors such as sildenafil, Viagra, PT-141 works directly on the central nervous system to enhance sexual arousal and desire. PT-141 is FDA approved for treating hypoactive sexual desire disorder, HSDD, in premenopausal women, but is also used off-label for erectile dysfunction, ED, and sexual dysfunction in men and women. Its unique mechanism of action provides an option for patients who do not respond to or cannot use traditional therapies. PT-141 exerts its effects through activation of melanocortin receptors, particularly melanocortin-4 receptors, MC4R, in the central nervous system. Central nervous system. Activation. MC4R activation in the hypothalamus increases sexual arousal and desire by enhancing dopamine release, which plays a critical role in sexual motivation. Peripheral effects. Unlike PDE5 inhibitors, e.g. sildenafil, PT-141 does not act on vascular smooth muscle directly, making it effective even in patients with vascular or endothelial dysfunction. Broader effects, PT-141 also interacts with MC1R and MC3R, which may contribute to mood enhancement and potential anti-inflammatory effects. PT-141 has several clinical applications, including hypoactive sexual desire disorder, HSDD, FDA approved for treating low sexual desire in premenopausal women, erectile dysfunction, ED, effective in men with mild to moderate erectile dysfunction, particularly those unresponsive to PDE5 inhibitors. Sexual dysfunction in women. Improves sexual desire and arousal in women with various causes of sexual dysfunction. Postmenopausal sexual health. Used off-label to improve sexual desire in postmenopausal women. Adjunctive therapy. Combines well with PDE5 inhibitors for patients requiring both arousal and vascular support. Potential future uses being studied for its effects on mood, motivation, and chronic fatigue due to its dopaminergic activity. Benefits. The potential benefits of PT-141 include direct central action to enhance sexual desire and arousal, effective in both men and women with sexual dysfunction, works independently of vascular pathways, making it suitable for patients with vascular or cardiovascular issues, fast onset of action, with effects typically occurring within 30 minutes to two hours. Minimal systemic side effects compared to hormonal therapies or PDE5 inhibitors. Risks. While PT-141 is generally well tolerated, potential risks include nausea and vomiting, the most common side effects, particularly at higher doses. Flushing, transient facial flushing may occur. Headache, reported in a small percentage of users. Injection site, reactions mild redness or discomfort at the injection site. Blood pressure changes, rare but possible transient increases in blood pressure, caution in patients with uncontrolled hypertension. Alternatives. Alternatives to PT-141 for sexual dysfunction include, for erectile dysfunction, PDE5 inhibitors, for example, sildenafil, tadalafil, or penile injections, for example, alprostadil, for hypoactive sexual desire disorder, flibanserin, ADI, or cognitive behavioral therapy, CBT, for sexual arousal issues, vaginal estrogen or lubricants for postmenopausal women, for low libido in men and women, testosterone therapy or lifestyle interventions such as stress management and exercise. PT-141 is administered via subcutaneous injection. Standard dosing, dose, 1.75 milligrams administered subcutaneously approximately 45 minutes before sexual activity. Titration, starting dose, 1.0 milligram, increasing by 0.25 milligrams per injection until the desired effect is achieved. Frequency, no more than one dose within 24 hours and no more than eight doses per month. 
Special considerations. Patients should be instructed on proper injection technique to minimize site reactions. Avoid use in patients with severe cardiovascular conditions or uncontrolled hypertension. Laboratory testing can help guide PT-141 therapy and monitor its effects. Baseline testing, hormonal profile including testosterone, estradiol, and prolactin levels, comprehensive metabolic panel, CMP, to assess overall health, cardiovascular risk assessment including blood pressure and lipid profile, monitoring. During treatment, blood pressure monitoring for patients at risk of hypertension, symptom logs to assess improvements in sexual function and side effects, Post-treatment evaluation, follow-up on sexual health questionnaires to evaluate therapy effectiveness, periodic cardiovascular assessments for long-term users. Case Study 1, Hypoactive Sexual Desire Disorder in a Premenopausal Woman A 38-year-old premenopausal woman presents with Hypoactive Sexual Desire Disorder, HSDD, reporting a lack of sexual desire and frustration in her relationship. Treatment protocol, PT-141, 1.75 mg subcutaneously, 45 minutes before anticipated sexual activity. Outcome, improved sexual desire and satisfaction reported after the first dose, with consistent benefits over six weeks of use. Case study. Two, erectile dysfunction in a middle-aged male, a 50-year-old male with mild to moderate erectile dysfunction, unresponsive to sildenafil reports, difficulty achieving sufficient arousal. Treatment Protocol PT-141, 1.5 mg subcutaneously as needed, titrated to 1.75 mg based on response, outcome, improved arousal and successful sexual activity within 30 minutes of dosing, with no significant side effects reported. Case Study 3. Postmenopausal Sexual Dysfunction a 55-year-old postmenopausal woman with decreased libido and difficulty achieving arousal seeks therapy to improve her sexual health. Treatment protocol, PT-141, 1.25 mg subcutaneously, titrated to 1.75 mg after two weeks of use. Outcome, significant improvement in arousal and sexual satisfaction reported within four weeks, with mild and transient flushing as the only side effect. In conclusion, PT-141 is a unique and effective option for managing sexual dysfunction in both men and women. Its central mechanism of action makes it suitable for patients with hypoactive sexual desire, erectile dysfunction, or arousal difficulties, even in cases where other therapies are ineffective. With careful dosing and monitoring, PT-141 can improve sexual health and quality of life for a broad range of patients. Want to introduce peptide therapy to your patients? Get certified with our free course at freepeptidetraining.com.